Hi and welcome back to Gen Yoga. It's the start of a brand new year, 2022, and I'm so excited to be back here filming for you. Although I must admit, it does feel a little bit strange being back in front of the camera after all this time off. I've had a really busy but exciting last six months. I started a new job, moved house, and got married. It's all been amazing, but now I'm ready to build the Gen Yoga community once again. So in this video, we're gonna look at what to expect from Gen Yoga in 2022. And I'm also gonna be doing my first ever giveaway. So stay tuned for that. So where did I go? Well, I've already mentioned that I started a new job, but I'm not gonna go into that here because it's not what we're here for. I also bought my first house and how about I give you a quick tour? Three, two, one, cue the B-roll. So what did you think? Let me know in the comment section. We're still not quite finished, but it's definitely livable now. So we're just gonna work on it a little bit more slowly. For a little bit of context, here's a before and after of the kitchen. <laughs> and so last but not least, the most important part of 2021, which was definitely the most exciting, was getting married to my lovely husband, Emil, who is also the cameraman and the creative director for all things to do with Gen Yoga. It was an absolutely amazing time and we got married in our favorite spot in the Lake District. I'm gonna show you some photos now so that you can get a little bit of a gist of what our day was like. Here's one of me with my siblings and new siblings. <laughs> Here's one of me and Emil as a newly wedded couple. <laughs> and here's one of us just having an awesome time getting confetti thrown all over us. <laughs> it really was such an amazing and memorable time. We even got to go away to Italy on a honeymoon and we feel so lucky to have been able to do that. We hired a Fiat 500 and at first, I'm not gonna lie, Emma was driving a little bit like Mr. Bean and we were absolutely wetting ourselves as we wound our way up the, the tiny little roads and the hairpin bends on our way up into the village of Ceriana. We stayed in a really old Italian town up in the mountains and it was truly amazing. So one of our favorite parts of that trip was actually the food, but I don't think that's surprising being in Italy. We had lovely pizzas, lots of red wine and really long lunches. It was just so amazing. And I can't wait to go back there actually. <laughs> Maybe we could even plan a yoga retreat. What do you think? <laughs> so over the last six months, I've had quite a lot of time to think about how I want to build the Gen Yoga community. And a really big part of that for me is to get a bit of a bigger focus on health and well-being. So although I still want to share my love for yoga, yoga series and yoga videos, I'd also love to share with you a little bit more about tips that I have and things that I do to try and keep myself feeling my happiest and healthiest in my day-to-day -day life. I think it's often really important to remember that on the camera I always look like I'm smiling and I'm happy, but that certainly isn't the case. So I really want the community to be an honest place where I can share with you my tips and tricks for dealing with the highs and lows of life. And I'd love to hear how you help to keep yourself feeling your best too. A massive part of being healthy is to find balance in your body, whether that's mentally, physically or emotionally. And that's what I think I'd really love to grow and share on the Gen Yoga channel. Something we've struggled with is finding the perfect spot to film the new Gen Yoga yoga videos. Here's a sneak peek of what we're thinking. What do you think? Social media really scares me. I find it a place where there's a lot of toxic positivity and you often don't really get that sense of what's real and what's not. But I'm gonna really try and get my page back up and running and I'd love to share with you like tips and tricks to make you feel your best. And in light of that, I'm gonna do my first ever giveaway. So you just need to head over to my Instagram account, which is at genyoga underscore. Make sure you're following me. Like and comment on my latest giveaway post 
for your chance to win one of my favourite candles, which is an orange and cinnamon one that's handmade in Cornwall, and a an lavender eye pillow. Both of these help to contribute to the most perfect shavasana of your life. <laughs> so for your chance to win, head over to my Instagram page and why not tag a friend? See if they'd be interested in joining the community too. And that's a wrap. So thank you for joining me for this little catch up video. Um, expect a new yoga series coming out next month and I can't wait to see you soon. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and drop me a comment to say hello. Links to the giveaway are in the description. Bye!